there is a baseball game that's happening and there's a fence that's sort of up in between a baseball game and then like a neighboring yard where if you could be high enough to see over the fence, you could actually watch that baseball game. And then there are three different individuals. There is a child who is much, much shorter than the fence line. There is somebody who is mid-height and if they stood on their tippy toes, they could probably see over the fence line, but it would be hard to stand on their tippy toes for long based on how high the fence is. They might even need to kind of hoist themselves up a bit. And then there's a tall person who is able to see very well over that fence line. And when I saw that image, to me, it explained equity really clearly when they talked about how equity comes in and it provides a platform for each person that is built just to meet that person's needs that helps them all enjoy the game in the same way, for them to all see the baseball game. So the child would receive two or three boxes to stand on to see clearly over the fence line. The person who had that midpoint height would maybe get one box to stand on and the tall person wouldn't get a box at all because they don't need a box. And so when I think about mental health equity, I think, who is having the hardest time being able to see over that fence line into their best lives? Honestly, if it was equity, we'd all be at the game inside the stadium, but who needs actually the most support and how do we get that done? 